Hi, this is Charlie from Benavia. Great to be with you again and hope you're having a great day. It's been really nice here where I am. We've had rain today and it's cool and so it's Mother's Day, so I hope you've had a special day. A couple of things, I want to read something to you and then I have some trivia that I want to ask you. What I'm going to read to you, it's called The Real Thing. The very first Coca-Cola was sold on May the 8th, 1886 at the Soda Fountain in Jacobs Pharmacy in Atlanta, Georgia. Dr. John Pemberton, a pharmacist and Civil War veteran, came up with a caramel-colored liquid in a brass kettle in his backyard. In, intrigued, he took it liquid down to the uh, pharmacy. There, the mixture was combined with carbonated water and sampled by several customers who loved it. Over the years, the company has employed numerous slogans. The most repeated theme in the 100 plus years of advertising for Coke is reflected in the popular campaign of 1969. It's the real thing. The thing can be said about Jesus. He is the real thing, the real choice. He is it, genuine, authentic, true. Consider what John wrote about him. This is Jesus, is both true God and real life. And Jesus said this about himself, I am the way, the truth, and the life. So don't be fooled by the claims of this world that there is a better way or that you don't need Jesus in your life. Jesus is the real thing. Make Jesus your real choice. Got some questions here I want to ask you, trivia questions. I'm going to ask you the question and give you a few moments to, to come up with the answer and then I'll give you what the answer is. Is the name of Arizona's second largest city spelled T-U-C-S-O-N or T-U-S-C-O-N? Is Tucson spelled T-U-C-S-O-N or T-U-S-C-O-N? Right, it's T-U-C-S-O-N. What five states border the Gulf of Mexico? What five states border the Gulf of Mexico? Okay, it's Alabama, Florida, Louisiana, Texas, and Mississippi. The rich 1880s were America's Gilded Age. Gilded means covered with what? Gilded means covered with what? Right, that's it, it's gold. What Colorado Peak inspired Catherine Bates to write America the Beautiful? What Colorado Peak inspired Catherine Bates to write America the Beautiful? It was Pikes Peak. Pikes Peak is right by Colorado Springs. That's where I grew up, it's a very beautiful area. People still drive buggies and live without electricity in Ohio's Amish region, true or false? People still drive buggies and live without electricity in Ohio's Amish region, true or false? It's true. Connecticut's capital is called the insurance capital of America. Connecticut's capital is called the insurance capital of America. What's the real name? Hartford, that's correct. Did the American Civil War last four, six, or eight years. Did the American Civil War last four, six, or eight years? Four years, that's right. Would you feel, would you find a Zamboni machine at a coffee shop or an ice cream, ice rink? Would you find a Zamboni machine at a coffee shop or an ice rink? <coughs> Excuse me, an ice rink. Who was the first person to sign the Declaration of Independence? Who was the first person to sign the Declaration of Independence? John Hancock. Hope you have a great day. God bless you and God bless the USA.